Japan opened up for foreign tourists in late 2022, and there have been many changes with who are allowed in and if you need any application or other documentations. Today, I'd like to go over all entry requirements for Japan in 2023 so that you can prepare for your trip and enter Japan smoothly. This procedure is tested by the passenger of Delta flight from Detroit in January 2023. But the situation might change time to time, so information in this video might get old. So please check the latest information for your country with the government website and your airline. Visa requirement. For the visa requirement for your country, please check the website of the Ministry of Foreign Affairs. I put the link in the description. There are 68 countries that have a visa waiver program with Japan, that is including US, Canada, Australia. And a lot more. In this case, you will be given a tourist visa upon arrival at the immigration counter. The tourist visa is valid for around 19 days for most of the countries, and some 15 days, and some 180 days. Vaccinations and quarantine. If you have received three COVID 19 vaccinations, you are allowed to enter Japan with no quarantine or contact tracing required. All 11 vaccines listed in World Health Organization are approved by the Japanese government. If you don't have three vaccinations, you must have negative COVID 19 test result within 72 hours before the departure to Japan. To make things easier and smoother for you at the arrival, a good idea is to register on the Visit Japan website and prepare information at least 72 hours ahead of your departure time. As of today, the Japanese government is using the website called Visit Japan as a program. This Visit Japan website generates three QR codes for quarantine, immigration, and customs based on the information you provide. First, go to the Visit Japan website and register for the new account. Enter your information and upload your documents, such as vaccination certificate, to the portal. And make sure you click the submit button. The form will be reviewed and you will receive an approval email within 24 hours after submission. Please fill the all the required form and make sure you have all the three QR codes for quarantine procedures, disembarkation card for immigration, and custom declaration. You can show the screen with QR codes with your mobile phone upon your arrival. You might want to save screenshots of all your QR codes and sections related to them. This is for the case you cannot connect to Wi Fi or the internet upon your arrival in Japan. When you check in for your flight, you will be asked to show your passport and your vaccination papers or negative COVID 19 test results. The Visit Japan program is not asked or required at the check in. It's used only for arrival in Japan. Now you are all set to fly to Japan. This Visit Japan program is available for arriving at Tokyo Night Airport, Tokyo Haneda, Kansai, Chubu, Fukuoka, Sapporo Shin Chitose, and Okinawa's Naha Airport. Arrival in Japan. Right when you get off the jetway, there will be a staff with pink vest. They will ask you to get your health check QR codes ready. They will then ask you to show the one for the quarantine procedures, fast track. Simply show the QR codes to the staff you talk to, and the staff will give you the pink slip. As you walk to quarantine, there will be a gate with staff. You can hold up the pink slip. And walk on through to the immigration. In case you don't have the pink slip, there is a counter to present your document for quarantine. There might be a long line, so filling the Visit Japan website and having the QR codes might save your time. To stop the spread of avian flu, there are yellow mats before immigration. At the immigration, the staff will direct you to the appropriate line. After clear the immigration, you will enter baggage claim. After you receive your luggage, 
you can activate your custom declaration QR code of the Visit Japan. With this code, you can go to the kiosk machine. They are clearly labeled and the staff can direct you to them. You have to scan your passport and QR code at the same time. The screen should turn blue, that means you can proceed to the exit. There are blue light marked exit with gates. Welcome to Japan. It depends on the time and the airport, but this flight from Detroit to Haneda, it took about 15 minutes from the airplane's boarding bridge to the baggage claim area. If you fill out the Visit Japan website, you get three QR codes for quarantine, immigration, and customs that you show them at each gate if asked for it. Again, this information was tested by the passenger on Delta flight from the United States on January 2023. If you experience something different, I appreciate if you could comment and let me know. For how to get to the city from the airports, I made one for Tokyo Narita, Tokyo Haneda, and Kansai International Airports. So please check the description below. Thank you for watching. Have a great trip to Japan. Have a great week until the next video.